how do you think and how do you feel about tonight's event? Do you have any comments to give? It's my first Pecha Kucha and first Pecha Kucha in, in Indonesia. Okay. Um, what to say? Um, it's a cool audience, cool uh, other speaker. The other girl doing the how to learn how to be in Indonesia. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's very fun. Okay. <laughs> a great organization by the Maverick team. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I'm glad I was invited. I was very impressed with the other guest speakers and the choice of topics. Okay. And I think it was very fun. There was a diverse range of topics from comedy to life to real, you know, experience. There was so much that we could learn from all the speakers and this is what it is about. Sharing and learning and growing through networking. So this is your first event? Uh, with with Kucha, yes. Yeah. This is my first time here and I was really very impressed. <laughs> you managed the 20 times 20? Yes, I survived! <laughs> Yeah, you did a really good presentation. Thank uh, you. Time. I try. I, yeah. I'm sure like people actually have to come here one time in order to, you know, to yeah. actually spread the words and everything. Ah, yeah. You have to experience it first. Yeah, it's a, it's a really good experience and it's very interesting, full of like interesting people. It's a really different type of networking mm -hmm. event that uh, amongst a uh, networking event I've been networking to. Event. Well, I think it really fits the theme of diversity. You have a very great diverse panel of speakers, and also the audience uh, came uh, are also very diverse. Uh, I really, really enjoyed it. I love being a speaker here in this uh, group of speakers. Um, yeah, as you maybe know, I was already part of Pecha Kucha in Jakarta yeah. in 2009, and I'm just so very happy that it's still going on until today, volume 15. And yes. It's still happening regularly and that makes me very happy and proud at the same time that I was part of starting all of this. To be honest, this is actually the first Pecha Kucha I'd ever heard of. Okay. Like, before this I'd never heard of Pecha Kucha. I was like, what is it? Um, so my impressions coming in is that it was, it's a really, really great event. Um, definitely not what I was expecting mm -hmm. and that's in a good way. It's in a good way. Um, as to the theme, oh, I thought the theme was actually quite, quite appropriate because you know, in Indonesia, you know, it's all about melting pot and yeah. it's all about the, you know, united by diversity. Um, so I think having a theme like that is a, I guess it resonates well with Indonesia. Um, yeah, I thought it was really good. Do you have any kind of uh, interesting theme that you would like to introduce to the next Pecha Kucha event? Um, I mean, personally, I'm always interested in Things concerning like the environment, environmental NGOs, people who are activists in that particular field of work, maybe that could be an idea for a theme. So um, environment, NGOs. Yeah, yeah that, that I, I would really like to hear about people who are really making a difference in that, in that field of work. Okay, so um, if you have another chance to participate in Pecha Kucha, uh, probably as a speaker or probably as an audience, what kind of theme that you would like, uh, we would like to have? Um, I don't know, I think the theme uh, today is really nice, but like, um, in order to, you know, um, have more personality to it, maybe, you know, we can uh, introduce some kind of more Indonesian-based Indonesian. people. Or like, uh, I don't know, spread the culture of Indonesia to everyone. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I, and uh, you know, I, I really like uh, personality too. So like, uh, instead of like organization, it's like a it's little kind of bit. Heavy, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's quite heavy, and uh, when it's casual, it's about one person. It actually will give more inspiration to like audience. I think personally. So again, what I, what I liked about the evening tonight is that the theme you've given doesn't restrict it in any way. It allows it to go in many directions. Um, so I think if you keep something along the same lines that you had tonight, it allows so many different creative creative stories. Creative stories. Yeah, so anything similar to what you had tonight. Okay. I, I'm personally doing a startup in the travel industry, Traveling so travel industry. is interesting for me. And I have another fashion and hobby and project for food. Uh, so 
Actually, recently I heard there is one molecular gastronomy restaurant in uh, in Jakarta, okay. Namaz Dining, Dining, I believe. So it seems the scene of uh, restaurants and bars in, in uh, Indonesia is developing. So maybe there is a team there. What what are the new experiences you can get in the dining scene in, in the city and country? I want Pechacucha to keep going on for another 15 or 30 volumes and maybe even spread to other uh, cities in Indonesia. I think there's already Pechacucha Bandung, I don't know if they still exist. I think there's already Pechacucha in uh, maybe in Bali somewhere, in Ubud perhaps. No? But how about like making it in some place really far yeah. away? I think that would be interesting. But I think that's really good. Thank you very much for the invitation, Pechacucha. Yeah, as I was explaining, it's the first event I've been to and hopefully not the last. So I hope to come along for the next one.